been here for mad long and I never got that option. I'm raining on her parade today because that's not what we're doing. Welcome to my channel if you guys are new and if you guys are not new then welcome back. I'm Janine. Today's Sunday, the start of a new work week per se. Have my socks in my hand because I'm pretty much ready and I'm gonna put my socks on and wait. I have about 15 minutes before I really really have to leave. So I'm gonna just put my socks on and chill. I have a slight headache right now which is so annoying but I'm gonna see how long it lasts for, like before it goes away. And if not, then I'm gonna take two Excedrin because I'm not trying to have a headache today. So I just want today to go smoothly so I can like start enjoying my day off from tonight. Because for me, the day off really starts from like the night before, really and truly. So that's what's up. I have lunch because last night I ended up cooking some curry chicken. So I'm gonna have curry chicken and white rice for lunch today, which love that. It's gonna taste like a true Sunday dinner, just not at home. And this week, I want to make sure that I go back to this manager and let him know that, listen, I think you didn't get me correctly, but what I was saying is, I don't want to work both day out of the weekend, every single weekend. So I want to either work a Sunday this week and a Saturday next week and, you know, vice versa. But I don't want to work a Sunday and a Saturday one week. I, no, that's too much. That's one week gone where... I don't get any at-home time with my significant other or whatever the case is. Like, I just want to be home. And I said this. And yesterday there was this new girl and he was telling the new girl, oh, if there's a specific schedule that you want, you just have to let me know. I've been here for mad long and I never got that option. I'm raining on her parade today because that's not what we're doing. You're not going to get brand new. First preference. First dibs on the schedule? I don't think so. So I feel like I need to remind him again so he gets what I'm saying because maybe he didn't get it the first time and it's understandable because they bear well he speaks English but I don't know what it is so I'm definitely gonna go let him know I can't tell him today because he's not gonna be there today and I'm off tomorrow so I'm gonna have to tell him on Tuesday when I go back but it doesn't bother me as long as he hears me and understands me then it works and we move okay but I had breakfast made a nice little breakfast and had that so now I'm gonna put these bad boys on and I think leave out. I also feel like I need to repurchase my Crocs because I haven't done that yet because honestly my Crocs served me so well um, in like cases like this where I have to stand for so long and I definitely need it okay because right now it's catching up to me and so I feel like this week before the week ends I'm definitely gonna rep repurchase that. I think probably on Tuesday or so. Hey Siri, remind me Tuesday at 9.30 a.m. to buy the Crocs. Okay, your reminder is set for Tuesday at 9.30 a.m. Because honestly, this long-standing, like, you have got to be comfortable. And the shoes that I wear right now, it's comfortable. But sometimes I feel like, and that's a problem that I have with sneakers, I feel like my toes are suffocating in it. So I definitely want to get the Crocs because that's more breathable because of the holes that it has and stuff like that. And I could still wear my socks and it still feels like, my toes are breathing, so I definitely need to jump on that. I'm wondering where my husband is at this moment. Definitely can't be too far. But, um, yeah, that's the plan. That's definitely the plan right now. My freaking head hurts. I feel like I'm going to probably end up having to take the painkiller before I leave. Because this is definitely not how I want to start the shift. Like, whenever I wake up and my head already hurts, like, it's almost like the day is already off to a bad start. Because when I have headaches, I'm just not in the mood, honestly. So I really hope that today is very smooth and very quick. The faster, the better. But yeah, I'm definitely about to go this time for real. I started this day in my life thinking it was going to be a one-day thing. It's been over a couple of days at this point. I literally just woke up. I'm going to freshen up these little braids that I have going on right now. And then um, tie it down and start getting myself together to go to work. I feel like I'm still sleeping, honestly. And I'm very annoyed that I feel like this. 
I need to pick up around this living room too. If my memory serves, I think I did pick it up last night before I went to bed. I don't understand why the pillows are over the place right now, but we're not going to complain. But first, I definitely have to do my hair because I need to make sure that it's ready to go when I'm ready to go. So I'm going to undo my braid, put some product on there, especially in the middle because I feel like the middle is all over the place, and redo it. And then, yeah, I think I'm going to shower afterwards and find something to eat, then put my clothes together to go to work. I'm tired. I'm really tired. Hi guys. It's way way later and I'm home a lot early because I've been having like the absolute worst headache all day today and so I waited until after everybody took lunch because it was just me and another girl working in the back and like two people in the front. So I waited until after everybody took lunch to tell the supervisor that I want to go home because my head is just killing me. What was on my face? Wow. <clears throat> so I told the supervisor that I want to go home because I'm not feeling well. And he was just like, um, yeah, you should keep warm. And I'm just like, oh, okay. Yeah, sure. And then he was just like, also, come here. So I went and Mans was just like, do you have a pregnancy test? And I'm like, bro, that's not it. It's okay. Thanks for your concern. But that's not it at all. My head just hurts like crazy and I have to go home, honestly. Like, I'll be fine. I'm pretty sure tomorrow I'll be good. But for right now, I really have to go home and just rest a little bit, you know? And um, so he was just like, yeah, okay. And I left. Because I ate this morning, I ate oatmeal. But I didn't even, I, I didn't, I, I, I think, I think that I didn't feel hungry. So I wasn't able to eat it off. I just ate like a small amount. I even left the rest of it on the table. Just now I seen the container inside of the sink, so I think my, my husband ate what was left, but I did not even eat it off. And I left work at 3.30, and I was there since 9.30. And I didn't even eat when I was leaving, but I was my head was hurting so bad, and I wanted to take the painkillers, but... I just felt like I needed to come home too. And I didn't want to take them on an empty stomach. So I'm just like, I'll just go home, find something to eat, take them, drink some water, lay down, and call it a day. I think I go back tomorrow anyways, because even though I told him don't put me for the weekends, I think he still scheduled me for the weekend. So I go back tomorrow, but at least I'm off early today where I can, you know, rest a little bit to be fully functioning tomorrow. I love Sundays because Sundays are like shorter days. So love that for me. Pimple, God. So yeah, and at one point I was wondering if it's because my braids were too tight, but these braids are not the type of braids that could get like super tight or whatever. Like they're so loose, it makes no sense. And I feel like too, I'm so annoyed with these migraines because I haven't been drinking coffee. Like I haven't had coffee in so, so long. So I haven't been drinking coffee like today. It was, well, you know what? I've had worse days, but I was just so out of it. To the point where, like, I was supposed to give a lady, like, three twenty-six as her change. And I just gave her the 26 cents. Like, I completely forgot about the $3 just because of how I was feeling. Like, it was rough. It was just so rough. And, like, being there and, like, being called by different people from different angles. You're, you just feel like you're all over the place. My, I can't. I can't. I can't. And I was even snacking in between, too. Like, in between the time that I ate breakfast and like the time that I left I was snacking I had some plantain chips and stuff like that so I really don't know what I don't know I mean ever so often I have these headaches where it's just like oh my gosh I can't I just want to lay down and sleep and want it to be gone by the time that I wake up so I guess today was just one of those days uh the headache is still here I just ate though and took two painkillers so maybe in like a half an hour I probably should be feeling a little bit better. I'm hoping it starts working. I take the Excedrin for migraine and normally they work wonders. So I have no doubts that it will work. But um, I'm going to just, I already have a queue set up on the TV and everything. So that's really what I'm doing right now. And I think I'm going to end this, what was supposed to be a day in my life. Now it's a couple of days in my life. I think I'm going to end it right here. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video, I really hope everybody feels way better than I do right now.